Hi there. This is Karen with Creative Estate Services. Just wanted to give you a teaser video of our upcoming sale this Friday and Saturday, June the 14th, 9 to 2. That's Friday, June the 15th, 9 to 2 as well. Uh, this home is out in Etowah, kind of off Warlick, up on a hill and to the left. I'll give you details on that um, coming soon. This family, he worked for uh, Bell South and traveled a lot. We've got a lot of great 1970s uh, curio cabinets, furniture. We do have a stressless chair behind me. I'll show you. There's art, there's toys. Um, we have a cadet sword, I believe, from the Citadel. There's the stressless chair. We have a lift chair. Multiple stems, multiple sets of china as well. Great large rug here. So I'm trying to back up. There's a soup terrine. We have a server from the 70s. The matching hutch, which is kind of cool with that leaded painting. And then the tables. We have, I believe we've got six chairs with this one. And these are really cool. It's really like, like you can kind of say, hashtag wedding planner. A great little flower arrangers right there. Just stick them in for table anointing. Uh, anointings, listen to me, decorations. We got some Wedgwood Blue Willow. Different interesting pieces. I like the, uh, I love the fact that on the inside of the cup, there's detail. I know. <laughs> And here's the creepy doll, baby secret. I had chatty Kathy when I was growing up. We have books. This is a large bookcase that is not attached and it is available. Some Christmas silver plate. This is a piece of original art as well. We have the entertainment system. It's all one unit. Okay, great little um, hall table. And there's the sweet couple that lived here. Let's get down the hall. A vintage sewing machine on the floor. Nice bed. Kind of a modern dresser there. There's a piece of East Lake over here in the corner. Shark vacuum cleaner, which I need to go home and do that. We have clothing. Um, men's clothing is 40 by 29, size 10 and a half shoes. Women's is petite, uh, 8, 10, 12, and some extra large coats. Vintage games and toys. Oh, look at that. Vintage Singer Oil. Go great with my featherweight. This is the most unusual bed I've ever seen. I think it's great. You've got the storage, you know, the kids could jump on it and it'd be high. It's got an excellent camera set up here. Let's see if I can get back. It's a handmade uh, chess set. We can't find the chess pieces though. And these are puzzle pieces. There's a great tripod in there. I'm gonna try and make it to the basement because he was a woodworker and he has puzzle, unfinished puzzle boxes, and they're so cool. This is the um, large bad bedroom now. Who did this? I think it's Lincoln Taylor. Mahogany bed. We've got costume jewelry. There you go with the furniture and the mirror. This is a great um, low number signed by George Rabb. It's 27 out of 45. It's a great little uh, lithograph print there. Not little, actually. Okay. Let's see if I can get you in. As I said, men's clothing. I'm not going to be able to get back in there and get downstairs. So walk with me as I walk kind of fast because I've got a garage. I've got a full basement. I've got the kitchen. Um, we've got Russell Rot in here. We've got, let me show you this real quick. Okay, here's the kitchen. It's a little wonky there. Uh, Royal Dalton, Corral. 
kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. Russell Wright. Oh, there's Rob staying out through the window. <laughs> there's Russell Wright. This is actually our tea set. We don't have the tea set, but we have the china. Um, washer and dryer is available. The washer's 250, the dryer's two. Um, here's the garage. I'm just gonna give you a real quick overview because I really do wanna try and get down the basement. This is a uh, modern Coke that has a city player cooler. We've got tools, upright ref uh, freezer as found. And that is really as an as found. It's, it's a little stinky in there. We got a big crock that is also as found. It's got a pretty good chunk out of it, but still it's great. Vintage on um, ironing board, which I love. Oh, look at the hydrangeas out there. My goodness, it's that time of year. I was actually harvesting garlic this morning. So, all right, here we go. Let me try and get you down downstairs that's one last look at the living room rob is lounging <laughs> resting <laughs> the man <laughs> falling asleep the teach <laughs> the teak bench is available poor man <laughs> he works so hard and does so well all right here we go so basement entry is outside and down these steps so we just are asking people to use caution and the handrail we're still cleaning up <coughs> Excuse me. Still cleaning up down here, sweeping and taking trash out. All right, so here's the treasure trove. You're going to hear the dehumidifiers. Great old books up here. By old, I mean, <coughs> excuse me, my goodness. By old, I mean scholastic books from when I was growing up. Oh, there's a trash can. Great Lexington um, showcase there. I have one of those little tillers I use all the time. We got tomato uh, steaks if you need them. We got some Christmas. This is a Bassett um, bedroom set. The rice bed is in the other room. Oh my goodness, this is such memories. Y'all know I, we just had another little baby. My kids, my brother had this and then I had this same thing for my kids on the back of their crib. The things we do, right? Memories, memories, so all kinds of cool toys. <coughs> Excuse me, I should have taken a drink of water before I started this. There's some uh, VHSs, games, Cliff Notes. Don't even know if anybody would know what Cliff Notes are. Some history travel books. Great books, filing cabinets, wardrobes. Uh, there's a box of vintage material that we need to look through, but it looks like he's already priced it. See what else we've got. Oh, let's go into the um, woodworking shop. Oh, look at that. I do not need to rescue sewing machines. That's what I have to keep telling myself. I do not need to rescue. All right, it's gonna be a little hard to hear in here because we've got the dehumidifier. So this is an overview. Uh, we do have a Kennedy two-part tool chest with the original box. So it's red, it's not the Craftmate, which are or whatever that is that they used to make. I don't know. Obviously, we need to clean up over here. We got old Coke bottles. Here's the rice bed. Oh, that's a great little trunk. And it's full of Boy Scout items. Let's see if I can peek in there. There's that. Oh, but I really want to show you. We've got a Lionel train. Oh, where did the boxes go? A little red radio flyer, some paper. So this gentleman made these. Aren't these just the coolest things? And somewhere hanging out on this shelf, I think, are my puzzle boxes, but I am not seeing them right now. So this is his woodworking supply. So we have the wheels you can make. We've got some vintage desks, wood chairs, toolboxes, tools, all kinds of tools. So again, this is Karen with Creative Estate Services. Um, this is our sale for Friday, June the 14th, 9 to 2, Saturday, June the 15th, 9 to 2. For information, you can go to our website at creativeestateservices.com or you can shoot me an email at creativeestateservices at gmail.com. Hope you enjoyed this. Um, 
I got to go home and get a lot of work done. <laughs> posting this video, posting all the information, sending out my emails. It's going to be a good one, guys. Just be pre When you come, though, I would just caution you. Be prepared that you're going to have to walk up hills and down hills. And just pay attention to the parking instructions. So this is the downstairs once again. Have a wonderful day. Thanks. Bye.